car park troop has made further inroads into Monkey Hill today. It is only a matter of time. The day they cross the dam to Monkey Hill proper, it will bring mayhem to the existing troop dynamics along Golden Hill Road. For now, Nulla Troop still holds the ground. But the fact remains that we have now four mega troops in a small area. Competition for goodies will only become more intense. As most of them still think the good time that the lockdown had brought isn't over yet. But progress has been made. Hopefully, they will get back to the good old days. But things may get worse before it gets better. A sister teasing and playing with its baby sibling. A baby sibling is a dream come true for every little girl in a monkey family. So I am now in Skullhead territory. Hopefully I can find Tina and Teensy again today on my special day off. Speak of the devil, there they are. Tina is one of the scouts today, right on the forefront on the border with Jubilee Troop. The 5 p.m. traffic is busier than usual on Golden Hill Road today, with both casual feeders and visitors. which may prove to be beneficial to Teensy, as Skullhead's troop will be more spread out today. The only problem is Tina is right on the forefront. It just isn't safe to do anything yet. Hold on, there's our gang too.
And to complicate matters, our gang has noticed my presence too. No, with all these players around, there is no way Tina will ever put Teensy down on ground level. And if she isn't on ground level, she can't be helped at all. And damn, Teeny is here too. And also the male who helped Teeny get back home. Teeny is still the same sweet curious girl. But her mothering instinct is hampering all my as well as the regular feeder's efforts. Poor teensy girl is getting scrawnier each time I see her. She is just skin and bones now. There is no way I can pull off anything here. Let's see whether the ground is quieter around the bend. A sigh of relief, it's skull heads ground. And only less than a dozen of skull heads fellows around. And forget about operant conditioning. I just want Teeny to disappear for a while. So off Teeny went, up the concrete slope to finish her goodies away from everyone else. Tina puts Teensy on the ground and enjoys her goodies with everyone else. Everything just falls into place for once. While I'm unzipping my ziplock of puree with Teensy busy scraping off any crumbs on the ground. Aww, Teeny! Nope!
and Teeny can't be bribed again. She doesn't want any goodies. She just wants to hold her baby sister. I can't hate Teeny for she is just doing what other girls at her age do. I had nearly used up all my goodies already to create that perfect window of opportunity before Teeny sneaked behind me and scooped Teensy up. 